Obtaining a degree in chemistry or biology provides a wide range of educational and professional options for graduates. Career options range from chemical engineer to lecturer to research associate to chemist, to name a few. This is 10 entry-level jobs for biology and chemistry majors. We'll help you figure out which job you should consider. But before going on with our video, hit that subscribe button to watch more videos like this one. Now, let's get going. Number 10, Chemistry Researcher. Chemistry graduates have several options for using their skills in a variety of fields, including chemical engineering, chemical and allied businesses, healthcare, and more. There are many various motivations to do research and many varied contexts in which to perform it. Thus, research jobs are more diverse than they look. You may work in a university combining research and teaching, in a pharmaceutical firm discovering and testing new drugs, or in a government-funded research center, ensuring that national healthcare keeps up with new findings. While the research scientist's work description varies, the majority of chemical research professions are located in labs where research is carried out by teams using scientific techniques and standards. Discovery of novel medications and vaccines, forensic analysis for criminal cases, increasing knowledge of environmental concerns, and creation of new chemical goods and materials are just a few examples of the various research done by chemistry specialists, such as cosmetics, paints, plastics, food, and drink. Number 9. Chemical Engineer Chemical engineers work in a variety of industries, including oil and gas, energy, water treatment, plastics, personal care products, pharmaceuticals, and food and beverage. Chemical and chemical engineering positions may be found in all of these sectors, and they're directly involved in the design, development, production, and manufacturing process of chemical goods and materials. Chemical engineers typically work alongside researchers who are charged with inventing and developing new chemical processes, sometimes integrating other sophisticated and emerging scientific fields like nanotechnology or biomedical engineering. Chemical engineers guarantee that chemical processes are efficient and safe, adjust the chemical makeup of goods to satisfy environmental or economic demands, scale up chemical processes for production, and use new technologies to enhance current processes. In the United States, the national average income for an entry-level chemical engineer is $70,642. Number 8. Forensic Science Biologist Working as a forensic scientist in the legal sector, alongside police departments or law enforcement organizations, will need you to examine and analyze evidence obtained during criminal investigations. Many forensic scientists specialize in fields including forensic odontology, dental evidence, forensic anthropology, human decomposition examination, crime scene investigation, and medical examiner responsibilities, requiring further study. In the United States, forensic scientists earn an average of $63,523 per year, or $30.50 per hour. In terms of pay, an entry-level forensic scientist earns around $38,000 per year, while the top 10% earn over $105,000 per year. Number 7. Pharmaceutical Representative The pharmaceutical business, which is closely connected to the healthcare industry, is massive in its own right, with a correspondingly big job market. Pharmaceutical chemists are needed to design, develop, analyze, evaluate, and regulate new and current medicines as demand for specialized and novel drugs rises. These chemists not only have technical knowledge, but also have excellent team, communication, and management skills, as well as an understanding of mathematics and analytical thinking. While synthetic pharmaceutical chemists, also known as medicinal chemists, are responsible for researching and developing new cost-effective drugs for the market, analytical pharmaceutical chemists are responsible for testing and chemical analysis of new drugs to ensure that they're safe for human consumption and comply with government regulations. In the United States, the average yearly salary for an entry-level pharmaceutical representative is $60,099 per year. Number 6. Biochemist In the fast-growing disciplines of biotechnology and biomedical research, biochemists play a critical role. Biology gives them the laboratory and scientific research abilities and expertise they need to plan and execute studies for new product development. Anatomy and physiology knowledge aids biochemists in comprehending the effects of medicines and technological solutions on the human body. They can present ideas and findings to peers and possible funding sources thanks to the presentation and writing abilities they learned as biology majors. 
biochemists made a median annual income of $94,490 in May 2019, according to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, BLS. The top 10% of earners made $182,870 or more, while the poorest 10% made $50,620 or less. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, employment in this area is expected to rise at a rate of 4% between 2019 and 2029, which is about average for all occupations. Number 5. Genetic Counselor Genetic counselors examine customers' hereditary composition and inform them about the possibility of passing on a genetic illness or handicap to their children. Adults who are concerned about the possibility of developing signs of genetic diseases later in life may benefit from their services. To complete the needed master's degree in biology, they must have advanced biology aptitude. They must be able to think mathematically, like a biology major, in order to estimate the possibility of various outcomes depending on the genetic predisposition of the patients. To assess the use of a fast-expanding corpus of information on the human genome, genetic counselors must have sophisticated understanding of the scientific process. Genetic counselors made a median annual pay of $81,880 in May 2019, according to the Bureau of Labor Statistics (BLS). The top 10% of earners made $114,750 or more, while the poorest 10% made $61,310 or less. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, employment in this area is expected to rise by 21% between 2019 and 2029, significantly faster than the national average. Number 4. Food Chemist Food chemists are involved in the research and development of novel foods for the market, as well as chemical research that extends the life of food. They also perform tasks such as checking the food product on several scales such as quality control and artificial agent control for the FDA, Food and Drug Administration. Food chemists research the structure, content, and reactivity of digestible items including ketchup, bread, french fries, and cake. They research techniques to make food that is more nutritious and lasts longer in laboratories, kitchens, and industrial facilities. The majority of people work a typical 40-hour week. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, chemists in the food production industry earn an average of $29.92 per hour, or $62,230 per year, in May 2011. Number 3. Health Communications Specialist Specialists in health communications are in charge of informing populations about health issues, particularly public health issues such as communicable illnesses, health management, and healthy living. Health communications experts are frequently engaged by hospitals or other healthcare organizations, and they may also oversee the institution's public relations campaigns, marketing initiatives, and community participation. Health communications professionals are responsible for presenting issues linked to human health and illness with a broad audience, which necessitates excellent writing and interpersonal skills. Health communications professionals make an average yearly income of $63,335 according to Payscale. The top 10% of earners made $84,000 or more, while the poorest 10% made $50,000 or less. Number 2. Agricultural Chemist The creation of molecular compounds for crop productivity and pest control is the responsibility of agricultural chemists. They also research the metabolic processes that occur in plants and breed plants to improve agricultural yield. Agricultural chemists' salaries in the United States range from $41,110 to $125,450 with a typical income of $68,149. Agricultural chemists earn between $59,296 and $68,045 per year, with the top 83% earning $125,450. Number 1. Medical and Health Services Manager Medical and healthcare executives spend a significant amount of time interacting with healthcare professionals and must be able to communicate scientific policies and procedures to them. They must be able to decipher scientific regulations relating to medical services and adjust programs as needed. Medical and healthcare executives frequently employ, oversee, and assess healthcare workers and researchers. As they evaluate applicants and workers, they must be able to comprehend the subtleties of their credentials and performance. Medical and health services managers had a median annual income of $100,980 in May 2019, according to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, BLS. 
The richest 10% made more than $189,000, while the poorest 10% earned less than $58,820. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, employment in this area is expected to rise by 18 percent between 2018 and 2028, significantly faster than the national average. With that, we'd like to conclude, but we would love to know what you would like to see next. Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more interesting content. Also, hit the bell icon button so that you'll get a notification whenever we post a new video.